Hey friends, so guess what? CB2 just texted me, or I just got a notification text. Basically said that my delivery is on the way. If you watched the last vlog, y'all know I, I didn't get my entryway table. And my stomach has literally been hurting all morning because I'm nervous that it's not gonna be in one piece. But I just said, claimed it in the name of the, in the mighty name of Jesus. <laughs> That is gonna be in one piece. So we're gonna have positive vibes. So my husband is in here getting it together. I didn't wanna take the current table completely down because I was nervous that it wasn't gonna be in one piece and then we're gonna have to sit here and do all the, all the other stuff. So we're just gonna move it somewhere until they get this table in. So let me change my battery. And once they actually come, I will show y'all what it looks like. I'm so excited so it was successfully delivered in one piece so um the base of the table is separate from the glass so it took us a little minute to um get it positioned correctly because when you move it you can't just slide it over you actually have to remove the glass and then move it over so let me turn y'all around this is what the table actually looks like you can actually see the base of it has like some texture to it, which I really like. I like the shape of the two legs. So I just kept two chairs up under it so y'all could see what it looks like with the chairs, without the chairs. Look at Malia over there. So now with this wall over here, the chairs definitely match with the wall gallery thingy, but our picture gallery. But my husband is like, now that he sees this cream, he's like, dang, that picture would look good. I'm loving all of the textures over here. The textures from the, the legs, the textures from the chair that y'all know I have. Bean's eating her cheese and smearing it in the chair. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. Anyways, um, so if we put this up here with the picture light, I feel like it would look really good. But a lot of y'all were saying we should keep the gallery wall because that's what makes it feel homey because there's pictures of the family in here. But honestly, like, I know who my family is. <laughs> I was just playing. But that I, I I honestly and truly think that this picture with either a picture light above it or two sconces on the side of it would be grand. What do y'all think? A part of me is like, maybe I should just keep the gallery wall. Anyways, if we keep the gallery wall, we're going to be moving it down, spacing it out. And we're going to do two picture lights above it as opposed to one 18 inch. It would be two 12 inches because we want them to kind of be spread out. And then over here in the corner would be the other light switch. So we're going to remove these later on today and um, actually just use blue tape to see where we actually want to place each of them, where we actually would place the picture lights and then where the switch is actually gonna be. So I also got the rug for the deck in that just got delivered. We're gonna see what this vase looks like over here. How do we like a cream? I don't know, part of me is like, girl, you need like a big, nice textured, or maybe I need something that's sleek since everything else over here is textured. And I don't want too much to be over here. I might just stick the candle. I might put this back in the tray. Y'all know that brass colored tray because that brass colored tray, I believe matches the picture light that's gonna go over here. So I think I might keep it this simple over here um, because the table is not near as big as that solid wood one. This is oval, so you lose a couple of inches, which I'm fine with. But I really like this table because now, like I was telling y'all, it's like, Still light and eerie. The, the the black chairs kind of breaks up all of the cream that we have everywhere in the house. So I love it. So we're gonna make a decision about what's gonna go over there in that area. Um, some people may ask, why would you get a glass table? You have kids, there's gonna be fingerprints. It's fine. I'm not choosing my decor pieces based on my kids. I'm not, I'm getting what I like and what looks nice, okay? So now I'm about to show y'all the rug. All right, y'all, literally everywhere I go, they follow. Anyways, this is what the circle rug looks like. I like it. Let me open this really quick so y'all can see um, how it flows. Hopefully no bugs come. But you see how this kind of has like that gray bluish undertone? 
it's not really blue but it comes off that way it's actually gray and then this has the same color can you sit your there behind down before you fall okay so i like how you have this textured rug same color look at that um and then it flows over here to the circle rug and it's not too square it looks really good let me know what y'all think and then we'll get a big plant to sit over there you know get the vibes going have the lights going so here's another angle look at her watch it roll off i know it's gonna roll off can y'all help her but yeah y'all i love this especially once we actually get the deck stained the color of the house i think it's gonna come together a lot more but i really like it let me know what y'all think see y'all now i gotta get my my thoughts in order um as to like what i'm gonna buy next i'm not opposed to buying like inexpensive type stuff i just don't want to make any large furniture purchases so i don't put myself on a veggie when it comes to like home decor and stuff all these big pieces we're done we're done with the exception of two chairs for the upstairs so um i am now gonna be searching for um like the plant that i want a planter to go out there in that corner area the um um a cream coffee table to go out there probably look at west elm excuse me we just i got stuff i need to purchase but i'm gonna make my list and figure out the time in which i want to do it hello friends Whew, i just drank me a flavor water baby it was grown some things be real strong when they hot. anyway so last video we were talking about did something to me hold on hold on just one minute okay i'll be right back okay so um last video we were talking about the um cabinet thing that i got to go in the master bedroom um and how i ordered some wallpaper stuff to put on the cabinet and that came in guys that came in so I'm about to show it to y'all. So I just went to Target. Um, you know we were talking about like impulse buys and how to get out of it. Anyways, Kenzie and Maddie, yes. comment, comment. I don't know why this toy going on. Anyways, so we were talking about impulse buys and I was trying to do better. Yada yada yada. I bought a lamp because it was really cute. It was Studio McGee. Um, they only had two there, and I feel like it's new. I don't know. But I was like, hmm, cream, just my alley. So I bought it. Hey, have a seat. Okay. But I throw this. Anyways, wait, where's my other one? Girl. Oh, the other one will be here tomorrow. Is today Wednesday or Thursday? I thought today was Thursday. I don't know how to look and see, but this is this one. It's like a linen. This is the cream one, I think, and we have a khaki one coming. So I think I'm gonna wait and see. And then this is the black liner for the shelves. Okay, well, here is the lamp. <laughs> I just like the two little Nadja things on the side. I just, I love different looking lamps. Like this is just, you know, it gave a little extra little character and I love the lamp shade. So y'all know the lamps in our bedroom. Um, oh, let me, let me tell y'all the brand of it. So, um, I'm gonna tell y'all the, the brand that my, my lamps and my master are duped for. They actually had them at Home Goods in black. Not just any black, a matte black. And like the knobs of it was like a, um, kind of looks shiny. But it's Kelly Wurstler. Wurstler? This is a post that they made showing that my lamps that I have on my master are available in black. I probably, if you were going for like an all black look, 
this lampshade, if you could find it in like a linen black or something, I feel like it would look really good on like the black on black. Ooh, you cannot tell me that wouldn't hit. But I mean, I think it's cute with the white lampshade. It just doesn't do it as much justice as the white one. But I love this black bottom. Anyways, it is Kelly, can y'all see that? Kelly Wurstler, I don't know how to get this focus. So that's who the dupe is for. Anyways, so the actual Kelly, let me just see if I can find Kelly, uh, Kelly West under period. Bit. Oh my gosh, y'all. Y'all wanna know how much this light, this lamp cost? Girl, I not believe this. So this is the lamp. Obviously mine doesn't have the gold base, but I love the lamp shade on these and I think I'm gonna try to find some lamp shades because it's similar to this one where it's pointed down. I just love that. I feel like that has like a more, I don't know, updated modern look. The lamp shades that mine came with, I think they're nice, but I think it would look even better and a lot sleeker with the, the lamp shade like this. But anyways, sir, ma'am, do y'all see that price? $1,029 and I got mine for eight, uh, 70, 69.99. So, why i don't know if this is made out. i don't know if it was handcrafted by god himself is the reason why they're charging a thousand dollars i don't know but i'm fine with my tahiri brand anyways but yeah i like this i have no clue where i'm using this at i kind of feel like hear me out i kind of feel like on the sides of the two chairs let me show y'all the two chairs that i was gonna get because i took a picture because i was sent i sent it to chelsea i was like what do you think about this chair, so this is the exact chair that I was looking at in Target. Um, it is linen cream. That is the actual throw that I already have on my bed and I was just bringing it to see if they the colors match and they do, it's a little bit off. Anyways, I like the combination of all of these. I already have the white, what's the name in my room, but do y'all think I could potentially put this on the little table, whatever table I end up getting that goes in between? She getting into everything. This girl just opened up the coat closet. Get out of there. Move. Y'all, y'all wanna know what's funny? My mama would, my mama um, had caught up on all my videos and she was like, what do my baby be doing in the background? But she making all that noise. I was like, what noise? Long story short, when I'm editing my videos, I don't hear her on my videos. Even though a lot of y'all will comment and be like, I seen Bean in the background or I heard Bean or Bean was singing. I think I got so used to tuning my kids out that it's like background noise to me. So my bad, it's a lot of yelling in the background, but guess what y'all, they live here. Anyways, so I thought this would be cute with two either oatmeal or cream chairs. Um, a nice, I want something just odd looking. Not a typical, I just want something different in between those two chairs and put this in between it, a little seat. I think that's what we gonna do. She gonna find a home, even if I had to sit her on my desk in my, probably. come on y'all. Sus has a temporary home until she goes upstairs. <laughs> I don't like this right here for like, for like ooh, Jesus, like for like permanent, um, but it'll do for now. And it's cream, like I feel like it lightens this up. I have the cream table, I have the cream desk. She's. She cute, she cute right there. So, ooh, watch out. The girl just all in my way. Um, so yeah, she gonna stay right there. But I definitely think it's gonna look cute in my in my bedroom, the way that I told y'all. Um, speaking of changing mine and all that different type, I don't want this chair in here no more. Did I tell y'all that? Did I tell y'all that? <laughs> Listen, hear me out. So, I was just over it. I, the more I get the area done, the more I'm like, um, I just love the color cream. I, even with my wardrobe, like, like the more I, every time I shop now, I have creams and tans in my hand. I don't know what it is but I can't be stopped. So, not anytime soon. I told my husband when he was in here the other day, he was like, but there's nothing wrong with the couch. I was like, I know that, but I don't want it. So, um, and not to mention, like I had this in the office at the last house. So 
It's not like I just purchased it and I no longer want it. She is gorgeous. But yeah. I think I want a cream, like something situation going on. I know I know, I definitely want like a couch. But I think I want it to be a cream couch. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so this is what the tray looks like. Y'all look at the tray and then the stool that I got from Home Good. Not Home Goods. What is the name of the child? Zara Home. It matches almost perfectly. So anyways, it still got tag on it. Y'all know how I do. But I like it. I'll link it down below. But I'm about to show y'all two different. Um, I'm going to show y'all downstairs. We're going to have to do the, um, the cabinet thing later today. Because I actually need to work. But I did take that vase down. The vase was throwing me off too. I was like, that's why when I edited it, edited it, edited it, I was like, do y'all think, look at me, it's nine o'clock, I got a bottle of wine. This is from last night, do not judge. But when I was editing, I was like, that looks a hot mess up there. Let me just go ahead and ask them because I knew if I didn't ask them, I was gonna comment it anyway. Can y'all see that? Need some chapstick. This is the khaki. And this is the cream. Does it have the colors on there? It's too snoot. It's too snoot. How smart of you. Anyways, if we reel in a little bit closer to the carbonate. I don't know if y'all can really see that. I am leaning more towards this tan one. Because if we look at these are the pillows on my bed. Y'all know the back side of them is like a linen type material. So if we also do these up against it, they both kind of match. You just have a lighter tone and then you have a darker tone. Again, this one, I feel like matches better with the black, but this one is brighter. So, I really don't know which one to do. Diddly, diddly, diddly do. I don't want to work. What about you? All right. Have a seat. Sit down. Thank you. Look what we've got. We've got a package from Crate and Barrel. All right, so I didn't tell y'all. <laughs> so the day that my dining table, breakfast nook, whatever you want to call it, table was delivered, I had went on their website to see Hold on. All right, I'm back. So, I'm gonna set y'all up right there. So, anyways, like I was saying. <laughs> like I was saying. Watch out, let me sit right here. Sit down and stop. Um, whenever they delivered that, I went on the, the site to look at the table because I wanted to see, um, how the legs are supposed to go, like how the distance apart they were. So anyways, when I went on there, I noticed that my table was on sale. So I called TB2 and I was like, hello, can I get a price adjustment? <laughs> Y'all listen, I don't leave any money on the table. Anyways, long story short. They were like, well, we actually see that they gave you um, a 15% discount or something like that. I guess they had did that for the inconvenience. I'm back. So, um, basically they already given me a 15% discount for the whole inconvenience and stuff. So he was like, you actually paid less than what it's on sale for. But since you called in, I was just seeing you a $25 gift card to either use it Crate and Barrel or CB2. I was like, thank you. Thank you, Harry. So I used my $25 gift card to get some random pieces from CB2. So I'm about to open this up and show y'all what I got, what I got going on. So I'm telling y'all right now, I have been wanting the, uh, the match thing. I was gonna order it off of Amazon. But as I had a gift card, I said, why not? And then I also have Shop Runner. I don't know if anybody knows what that is, but it's basically where you can get two free day shipping. <laughs> I mean, free two day shipping. But you have to have a minimum order of $25, of $50. So I had to throw some other stuff in there in order to meet that. <laughs> but this is what I really wanted from there. 
Nope, that's not it. This is it. This is what I actually wanted. Cause I'm gonna put this up on my countertop in the in the kitchen. It's not broken. Woo! I thought I got the shorter one. What is this? Did I need it? No, but I love it. And my little burners that I got from Amazon, I'm sick of having to charge them and I don't know where the chargers are. So, matches it is. We we actually use the throw back matches, you know, the ones in the red and blue box with the little red strip on the side of the box. That's what we have, but I said, no, no. I'm here for the aesthetics. So I got her and I'm really excited about her. So I'm gonna put her on top of a tray with a nice candle until I get a big vase that I want to use. The other thing I got. Why does it sound like there's a lot of noise? My battery's dying. Hold on. In action. All right. The other thing I got. <laughs> Baby, we're gonna do a little refresh with a little coffee station, coffee tea station. I thought this was cute. I think it was only $9. Tell me this ain't cute. Oh, this wrong way. Tell me this ain't cute. Tell me that's not cute. Tell me that's not cute. <laughs> it's bigger than I thought it was gonna be too. My hands are ashy, but yeah, I'm gonna fill this with some honey. And this is gonna make a very nice reel. A little slow motion action. Pull it up. Ooh. And then put it in this girl. Gonna make me some tea now. No, I'm gonna do that for Saturday morning. So that and then the last thing also purely for the aesthetics i have no use for this at all it's for creamer again i think this was like 12 dollars. very inexpensive but i'd rather do this than pay ten dollars in shipping to me ten dollars in shipping means i'm paying ten dollars for air that's just stupid when i can get little gadgets like this tell me she is not cute somebody come look at this Y'all, these are so cute. Like, I feel like these were made for idiotic people like me who just <laughs> like aesthetics. So, this will be a cute little real thing as well. Fill this with crema. And then, girl, you have no business. So, these are the three things I bought. Look at this. Tell me this ain't cute. Wait. Where'd you get that? See this in Isn't it cute? Mm -hmm. I'm putting in some Kramer. Do me a little coffee thing. And then look at this little honey holder. Mm -hmm. so I'm raising them. I'm raising lunatics, y'all. I'm raising Did them to be a lunatic like me. Yeah. You like everything I bought, don't you? Mm -hmm. I knew it. Is this supposed to still stay on you? Because I was going to fill this little sticker off. Anyways. <sighs> That's it, that's the order. Good morning, happy Saturday. As you can see, I'm editing the vlog that you're currently watching. But anyways, I wanted to show y'all. So I think I showed y'all, I haven't added those clips in yet, hold on. So earlier clips, I was asking y'all which color y'all think I should go with and then I made the decision that I was gonna go with the khaki. So I put the khaki in here just to see what it looked like. And do y'all see how much more you can actually see the decor? So I'm gonna add the cream one in down here because another update. <clears throat> what you reaching for? Look at it. Girl, the house is a mess. What you want? I don't have my tripod up here. I'm gonna sit y'all. Yeah, we brought Bean Crib into our room to try to train her to sleep in her crib. Um, not actually working out, but consistency is key, right? All right, so I'm about to open up <clears throat> this cream one really quickly to see what it looks like in there, and um, <laughs> I'll go from there. These are only like six dollars a piece, but like I told my husband, whichever one I don't use, I'm sending it back. Why would I keep it? I don't need both. Jesus, Louisa's. Take that right 
I'm over here breaking stuff. Do not touch. Look at it, y'all. Okay. Oh, there's my tripod. <laughs> All right. So those are the two different colors. I don't know if it's really picking up on camera. Let me get down, huh? So which one do I like? Oh, so <laughs> I'm all over the place. Okay. So this one, which is about to fall, I kind of like the, I'm going to go with the cream. I'm going to go with cream. I'm so glad I actually put this in here because the cream, I feel like matches with the chairs that I just purchased, which is another update I have to tell y'all about. <laughs> Bean, please stop. Go on. Bean, Malia, Malia, stop. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to go with the lighter color. Yeah. Hold on, y'all. I know I told y'all in the last vlog that I was trying to basically I'm I was praying over these pottery barn chairs, child. <laughs> but I don't really think that I want to spend that much money on those chairs. And I'm just being honest. There's some yeah, y'all already know. It's some things that you you know it comes down to the person. Certain things you want to spurt on, certain things you like, you know what? Because here's the deal. My living room, I don't like anybody to be in there. I don't like anybody sitting all over my furniture, even though sometimes that is the case. But that's why we have the loft. That's why we use our living room furniture from our last house in the loft so you could lounge. So that the living room could just be pretty. And you can occasionally sit on there. But I don't want you just lounging in my living room. But... I don't want to be that way with our bedroom. I want us to have chairs that we can actually sit in and relax in and then I not be obsessing over the fact that I spent or that we spent so much money on them that I don't want you to sit on them. So, sorry that was dark. Uh -oh. That is not made, told you guys that, do not judge. Um. Anyways, so I ordered some chairs from Tarjay. The chairs that, was I talking about earlier in this vlog or last vlog? I don't know, I can't remember. I went ahead and ordered those. They came back in stock. So I ordered the first one. There was only one in stock. And then I just so happened to be on the Target app <clears throat> and looked at it. And I was like, wait, they have another one in stock. So I ordered both of the chairs. They should be here early next week. So y'all should see it. Maybe on Wednesday's vlog, maybe on Sunday's vlog. I don't know. Depends on when it gets here. I think that that will bring more of the cream tone in here so it's kind of like cream whites black and tans like a combination of those colors which i feel like kind of flow really well together okay also here is what it looks like with the wallpaper up so when you're just looking at it like this it does look like it blends in with the wall so it kind of looks like the back of it is also glass and the background of it is just the wall which i like that it's not too dark and now as you can see everything kind of pops in there um to the naked eye you can't see where the wallpaper separates you can't really see the bubbles in it unless you look closely so if we're zooming in and we're looking under a microscope <laughs> but i'm not gonna fix this y'all can't nobody see that it's doing what it needs to do the other part is like right here if i zoom in or go closer you can see where i did this as its own strip and it's kind of like know kind of raggedy right there i was going to cover these but it kind of looks bulgy whenever i did it so i'm leaving it like that for now it blends in with what i have up there so um but you know my husband hasn't seen it yet so he'll probably be like yeah you need to cover those and make them blend in with the rest of it now that i'm looking at it i probably should do that but anyways this is what it looks like and like i told y'all i took that off this is not staying here. I found this on sale at Target a couple weeks ago, so I bought it. <laughs> and I'll figure something out, uh, something to do, out something to do with it. But with it being right there, it makes me kind of think I do want a tall plant to go right here. But I'm not 100% certain yet. Anyways, happy Sunday. Y'all know something different about me. I'm looking a little aging. I don't got on nobody lashes, baby. I was in the bed last night. I said, I'm sick of these lashes on my face i rub them to where like my natural lashes are not completely gone i got a little something some little treatment to get me right i hope i ain't got no bigger than my nose 
and then my skin is like breaking out from that um it's the ordinary stuff i think i was just using too much of it and it was probably a shock to her she was like wait a minute <laughs> We're not used to this. So I am going to go to Sephora today. Y'all see it as part of the other vlog. If I get anything, I might not even go. I might just be lying to y'all like usual. But, um, what was I saying? Before I got distracted about my nose to lashes. Speaking of lashes, I am not done with lashes. I just need to make sure that when I get them, I get the, um, hyperallergenic or whoever puts them on top of it. I just don't have time to be putting on my own lashes all the time. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I put my own lashes on by the end of wherever I'm at. It's hanging. I just don't have time for that. Y'all already know the whole, the whole deal. Y'all know how I feel about my fake lashes. But it, it felt good to wash my face this morning. I just look, I just look like, I just look a little refreshed. I look like I'm on vacation. And it was a good night. And I'm waking up refreshed. Period. So anyways, um, thank y'all so much for tuning in to today's video. I really hope y'all enjoy it. I hope you have a blessed and happy Sunday, a blessed and productive week. And I will see y'all on Wednesday. What are we doing on Wednesday? We'll probably do the bathroom on Wednesday. I think we're going to do the bathroom on Wednesday. Anyways, see y'all later.